Hi everyone, Len Carlson here. I'm about to demonstrate some kayak rolls for our family visiting from Europe. Siggy, Manuela, Benny, and Lisa. And I'll be using my Nigel Dennis Romney kayak and my Greenland stick paddle. Now kayak rolling was originally developed to, uh, as a self-rescue technique in case you got knocked over by a big wave. And the most basic role, which I'll show you first, if you get knocked over by a big wave, it's called the extended sweep roll. And it goes like this. Oh my God, a big wave. Whoa. And then another version of the same thing, but without extending. Keep drifting, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, and now, another similar self-rescue called the butterfly roll. Called the butterfly because of the way we open up at the end. Now the previous three rolls, you'll notice, I landed on the back deck. Now I'll show you a roll where I land on the front deck. Now, when the Greenlanders got tired while they were hunting seals, they would take a nap like this. That's called the balance brace. Another way they would rest is called sculling. Now, the last rolls I showed you were using my Greenland stick paddle. Now I'm going to show you a roll that uses this little stick. This is called the door sack, which in Greenlandic means throwing stick. And it is what the Greenland Eskimos use to throw a spear at a seal. Okay, now that you've seen how wet I get when I roll, you would probably bet anything in the world that I could not roll a kayak with a lighted cigar and keep it lit. Okay, you realize this is a lighted cigar indeed. Still lit. And now, a lot of times when you're out paddling, especially in rivers, you can come across a low bridge. In the event that happens, you don't panic, you do something like this. Once I get turned around. Paddling along. Oh my God, a low bridge. Well, I showed you a few of my rolls, and kayak rolling is a wonderful sport for all ages. I'll be 73 in September 2015, and I think kayak rolling is helping to keep me feel young. Thank you.